how do you like the real world, Jesse? <laughs> I never knew people lived like this. I hate to say it, but I'm ashamed to be a Collins. So your father doesn't know you're working in the mines. <laughs> Are you kidding? He thinks I'm back at Princeton studying engineering, and it might not be too healthy for me if anybody else found out I was a mine owner's son. richer every day. And what do we get? A black lung, or crushed in some damn cave-in. For what? So he can get fatter, and our wives and children can starve. Who the hell are you? I'm Duncan McLeod. He's a friend of mine. Friend? Is he one of Colin's private cops? Yeah. Are you a Pinkerton? Nope. And how do I know that? Because I said so. <laughs> I knew you weren't no cop. Your suit's too good. <laughs> Six weeks we have been sitting on our asses, waiting for Collins to negotiate. And what does a bastard do? He brings in his own damn army. He's not gonna negotiate, Tom. He's gonna bring in scabs. We can't win. Like hell we can't. No, of course we, we can hit him where it hurts, in the pocket. Yeah. You tell him, Tom. We can blow the mine entrance, and then burn down his damn house. <laughs> Show him what it's like to live like an animal. You're dead if you do. What do you know about it? I know the Pinkertons are just waiting for an excuse to earn their eight dollars a day. They're here fighting for money. We're here fighting for the right. They'll back down. They won't back down. They kill people like you for a living. Better a bullet than to die slowly in the mine. Yeah. Yeah. Are you with us on this, Jesse? I don't know. Look, Jesse, you've got two choices. Either you're with us, or you're against us. And I don't think that you want to be against us. 